Hey kittens, welcome or welcome back. So today's video is an answer to a poll I posted on my community tab. So today I'm going to be sharing seven different journal spread ideas for your six ring binder. So we're going to be starting in my A7 binder. So the first journal spread idea you can try is one about your feelings. So writing about your feelings is a great way to get those emotions out and to also clear your mind. So here's a look at my purple spread I completed on how I have been feeling overall. And you can also focus on one feeling to journal about like I did for my anger journal spread. And another example of this is a journal spread I did on sadness. So for this one, I did a pink and purple theme. However, the color scheme and the aesthetic you use is completely up to you and your creativity. So now we're going to my A5 binder to show a journal spread I did on my favorite singer. So completing a journal spread on your favorite thing is also a great idea to try. So whether it's music, food, a TV show, or even Sanrio characters, these can all be great ways to show your appreciation while adding a really fun journal spread to your six ring binder. So another journal spread you can try is one about a special event. So here's one I did on my birthday a while ago in my A6 binder. So you can do one on things like a concert or a trip, or you could also do one on your birthday as well. Also having goals as a journal spread is another idea you can try. So whether it's related to fitness, or maybe you wanna do one about your career, or maybe certain classes you wanna take, or even where you wanna be one to five years from now, these are also really great options that you can try. So next up are spreads on affirmations or positive reminders. So here I'm showing a spread that I did to remind myself to take care of myself. And here's one with the affirmation that I am lovable on it. Topics are also a really good spread idea. So whether you wanna focus on the weather, you can do a spread like I did in my A7 binder about it. Or if you wanna to stick to a certain subject, like the spread I did on self-love, that's also an idea that you can try. And last but definitely not least, completing journal prompts as a journal spread in your binder is also a great way to hold yourself accountable to complete them. And by the way, I'll be doing daily December prompts on my community tab, so be sure you'll subscribe to my channel so you can have access to those. So here's a few more spread examples if you guys want to do some on things like self-care or even washi tape swatches or you can even do a spread on cookies if you love them like I do. So feel free to share other journal spread ideas in the comments below and I love you guys so much and thanks for watching kittens. Adios!